Hi everyone, today I want to do a what's in my purse video. I've never done one of these um, and I changed my purse out to this one. It's a Cynthia Rally. It's bright red. I thought maybe that would improve my mood a little bit. I kind of been in this funk that I don't know. It's just been it January has just been a very long month, but it's almost over. Today's the 25th, and speaking of that, it's Ashley's birthday today. Happy birthday, Ashley. I love you with my whole heart. You're the best little girl anyone could ask for. You're just, you're absolutely the best. Anyway, happy birthday, and I hope you have a really great day. She is so sweet. She is just the best girl, and today she is... I got to think about this. I think she's 27 today. Holy cow. That makes me feel old. Anyway, happy birthday, darling. Um, so what's in my bag? Like I said, I've never done it before, but here we go. Um, the first thing that I see in there is my Chanel little makeup bag and I'll tell you this is not usually in my bag but I'm going to my mom's and I'm going to um, like probably do her nails or maybe give her a pedicure or something I don't know so I have this in there for that um, I have my glasses in there because I can't do nails without my glasses I have my nail envy this is Fruit Machine from Butter London. I just got this L'Oreal Metallic. They have a new line of metallic out. Um, a base coat. Another base coat. Anyway, some... Oh, and then this is another new one I got. So, I don't know. You know, I put those gel nails on my mom. So, I'm not sure. I'll probably give her a little pedicure. And I'm going to change my nails out today, too. So, that is in my purse, but like I said, <clears throat> it's not normally in there. Um, this is my wallet. I've had this wallet. I've had this wallet for about six months, but I've had this type of wallet for years now. I like the, you know, that you just open it and look inside. Everything's in there. I am a receipt keeper. I keep receipts. So I have a bunch of receipts. Um, my social security card. I have my Sally's beauty card. My um, Idaho lottery. My casino card. Oh, here's my... This is a good one. This is my student ID from ninth grade. Look at... I look just the same. That was um, 1969 to 1970. I think that was the shortest my hair's ever been in my life. Um, one thing though, when my one year my son my son played football, he did all kinds of things, but he played football, and to get into the football games was like six dollars. But if you had your student ID, it was a dollar. So one time I. Mr. Mickelson was taking tickets and I gave him my student ID from 1969. He let me in for a dollar that time, but he told me that it wasn't going to work all the time. Anyway, so yeah, that's my wallet. I Like I said, I've had this one probably six months, but before this one I had a turquoise one that I had for years and I literally wore it out. So I really do like that style of wallet. Um, oh, I played cards the other night. Um, Wednesday night I went down to the community center and played Pinochle. This is my score sheet. I didn't do very good. One game I was in the hole. Um, this guy right here was my partner one time. I had 410. He was not very happy. I didn't like him as a partner. I hope I don't get him. He and he probably hopes he doesn't get me because yeah, he wasn't very happy with that at all. Um, oh, this is my little this is a Poochie designed pouch 
and this was from the Guerlain bronzer. They did a collaboration with Pucci, and there was a bronzer, and then they had a brush that they sold separate, and the brush came in this pouch. And I just love this little pouch, and I keep it. I have my earphones in there, and I have a rosary. My rosary is in there. And I just keep that in there, so I know where my earphones are. Um, I have a atomizer. This is from Sephora. Every year, at the end of the year, when Sephora has their big sale, they sell these for like $3, and I usually buy two or three of them. And then what I do is I put the sample perfume, you know, that you get, the ones that are the non-spray, if I like them, I will put them in these atomizers. And um, that way I'll have them. This one has got Amazing Grace in it, which is the perfume that I wear all the time anyway. So I had a little sample that was like a non-spray sample. Um, this is my little makeup bag. I take this with me everywhere. Um, what's in it mostly is lipstick. This is that lip gloss that my friend Deanna sent me that I love so much. I love this stuff. I use that a lot. I have a little Guerlain um, sample lipstick. It's just kind of a sheer pink. I like that little sample. I also have a little sample from Dior. I don't know what the name is. I need my glasses. Oh, here's some glasses. I have glasses everywhere. Dior Addict Extreme. And this one is kind of a more red than the Guerlain. But I like that one. This is my favorite. I've been reaching for this one, which is surprising. The name is Bewitching Coral. And usually I don't like coral type lipsticks. But this one is gorgeous. My friend Deanna sent that to me also. I love that one. I have a Tarte Lip Surgeons. This one is in Fever. And it looks kind of like bright red, but it goes on more sheer than what it looks. I also have this little sample tart, and this one is called Moody. That's a good name for me the last few weeks. It seems like I've been in a mood, but I like that one too. I like that color. Um, I do have this lip cream. It's called Cream Puff Collection 2000, and I must have got this in a one of my boxes, like Glossy Box, or maybe, um, I don't know, Birch Box. It looks like a NYX uh, lip cream, but it's not. I've never heard of that, but I have been using that. I have a Buxom lip gloss. This one is in Katie. Um, I like that one. These are all, I could probably take half of these out because they're all kind of the same color. I have a lip butter in Lollipop. That one's a little bit brighter. Um, oh, and this is my Bobbi Brown Lip and Cheek Pencil. And I know I've told you guys this story about this before, but I bought this at Nordstrom. Um, okay, so Ashley's 27 today. When she was probably 14, 15, and Jilly would have been 13, you know, right around that age, when I first started letting them wear makeup, we went to Nordstrom's one time for a, it, we were back to school shopping, and I took them to the cosmetics counter and bought them, um, I started, they liked Clinique, and I think that's what they, like, started with as far as makeup. But I did buy them each one of these also, and I got one. 
and I bought the sharpener to go with it and I've used it all these years but it's still good it's not um, it doesn't smell bad or anything it smells like a pencil like when you sharpen a pencil but I can't tell you how many times this has saved me because if I leave the house without um, blush this works great because you can just put it on as like a little blusher and I just draw a little bit on and use my finger and blend it in and there you go and I don't like I said I can't tell you how many times over the years this has saved me I have this little mirror that I put in there um, again my friend Deanna sent that to me I have um, a key to my mom and dad's house. That thing looks like it's seen better days. Another rosary, which a spare rosary, I guess. One can't have too many rosaries. This one is made from um, Connemara marble from Ireland. I don't know why I have two rosaries, but I guess, and I have a house key. You know, there have been times, like, I've been at funerals and things and rosaries where people didn't have one. People like my kids, usually, so that extra... Oh, and they have a Band-Aid in there. That rosary has come in handy, you know, my extra one. Um, I have this pin in my purse. I just bought this. I think it's really cute. I also, my phone's over here charging, but I usually always have my phone. And look at her, how cute is she? She's actually outside right now, and it's pouring down rain. But I bring her in, and I have my car keys. Um, I brought her in, and she doesn't ever want to, like, she keeps wanting to go outside. I have my checkbook, like... I don't know why I have my checkbook. I can't remember the last time I wrote a check. Oh, I got a ticket. I need to take care of that. I want to see when the last time I wrote a check because I don't, I don't write checks. Oh, I wrote one 12, 13, 12 for $75. I don't know who I wrote it to, but I bet it was a gift. That must have been like a Christmas, probably to my nephew that lives in Florida. I bet I sent him $75. Yeah. And then before that, I hadn't written a check since June. And I remember I had gone to the grocery store and I had actually been online shopping and left my wallet on the table. And I got to the store and I didn't have any wallet and I had to write a check. So... I guess it is good to have a checkbook, even though I don't use it very often. Um, I got pulled over the other night, and it was kind of funny. He said I was speeding, and I was like, whatever. And he took all my stuff, and he headed back to his car, and I said, uh, I hollered at him, a warning would be all right. And he came back, and... He said, well, it's your lucky day. I just got a call I have to go to. But tell me, were you wearing your seatbelt when I pulled you over? And I wasn't. I think he probably wanted me to lie to him and tell him yes, because he was in a hurry. So he did write me a seatbelt ticket. It's $10. And I need, to, I need to write a check and get that sent in and taken care of. But, yeah, that's everything that's in my purse. It's not nothing very exciting. And six months from now, if you looked in my purse, it'd be the same thing. I pretty much keep the same thing in there. Um, I want to show you really quick on my nails. I have this polish from Lisa. I can't say that name. It's called Fairy Taupe. One of my readers of my blog, Linda, sent this to me. And thank you so much, Linda. I really like it, but the thing is, up here on top is a little button, and it has a light on the wand, so when you paint your nails, you can see what you're doing. And what I want to do is clean this brush and see if I can't use it with my other polish. Thank you, Linda. I love this. 
Anyway, I'm about to run out of time, so thanks you guys.